people almost wait for to a certain extent where they say, you know, when I get to this point, when I have this much money in the bank, then I could do that. Some of the things that I really love about this industry is that you don't know exactly what your day is gonna look like. You gotta know what your end result and your end goal is, but the way you get there, you gotta have some flexibility because if you're too rigid working with cattle, those cattle get a say. They might not go through the gate you want and you have to be able to adjust. And for me, I love that because it keeps me kind of mentally sharp where you have to make those calls on the fly. You know, I think that shift has just been so positive. And I think from a veteran perspective, this is a great industry in that, you know, not only do you have the opportunity to be outside more, but you also have the opportunity to do things that I think there's a lot of parallels. So our path to where we're currently at here at Little Belt Cattle Company, we started out west in Idaho. Our number one spot where we wanted to be was in Montana. We always had the dream of coming back here. This is ultimately where we wanted to raise our family and our kids. After getting out of the Navy, I went to work for a company that Tim had started. I started working there doing business development and sales based on kind of my experience from the Navy. And after coming off of the high action job as a Navy SEAL going to an office was not the best fit for me. And so I started out helping friends at ranches because it was something I always really liked to do and wanted to learn more about. The experience to be able to work outside in and with nature, I think that to me is the human experience. I think humans weren't designed to sit behind a desk their entire lives. I know for myself, the way I feel at the end of the day, after having the opportunity to do what I now do, I love the fact of like, I can go to bed tired because we've put in a good full day. You can go to bed after breathing fresh air all day and actually having to do physical and mental work. My stock handling skills have improved substantially from the first day that we started or the first day that I went to help friends to where they are now. And most of that is being more patient, working with the animals to let them kind of make the decision on their own. And a lot of that comes from great mentorship and great people that have helped us. The stewardship that happens over multi-generations at these ranches, whether you've owned them for three years or a hundred in three years, is that it all comes down to how you manage and take care of that property. And the better that management is, the better your business is gonna do. So when the opportunity came to start Little Belt Cattle Company, we started doing a lot of research and using land.com and working with a realtor team at Livewater Properties we were able to really kind of take that and present it to those folks and find the right place to do what we wanted to, which was ultimately to run a production agriculture business in beef production and cattle production. They've done a great job in compiling all that information, but also allowing you to build your own education all in one place. I think that's something that has been extremely valuable on educating yourself as a customer, whether that's you buying, you selling, and it saves you a ton of time because you don't go waste your time looking at a bunch of properties that ultimately won't work for what you're trying to do. I think within all of our own lives, this is just the puzzle piece that fits for our lives that gives us purpose and value. I think that everybody wants to feel in what they do professionally.